All right, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can draw uh, quantum circuits using LaTeX. Before we are going to start our business, you're going to need to download this zip file, the qcircuitmaster.zip. Once you download it, I have put the link where you can download the zip, this zip file below, down to this video. And once you download, extract it and you will find uh, these files. And we have two text files. This is a demo and this is the uh, tutorial about this uh, package, a full tutorial about it, okay? And, but you're gonna need to work with it. You're gonna need this qcircuit.cty copy this file and paste it where your text file is located at once you paste it here it is the, i have already pasted and this is my text file that i'm working on and this is my editor and once you once you open up your text file and uh, you use or import this package as use package of q circuit and inside the option you're gonna need bracket and qm like this and let me go to my frame i'm using the beamer class and you can type your quantum circuit like this circuit okay this is oops circuit boom boom and inside this circuit before you have to define the widths in the uh, the the height and this is the width like 0 0.5 am and at row uh, i want 1 em and inside there just to start by typing and the symbol this is a row uh, a column sorry l and uh, again this command line l uh, stick this is just for showing the the input and let me use Kate has an input. Hello, Kate. The Kate is Kate C. And let me concat with a wire in it. And wire. And after a wire, add another wire. And you can make like this. And let us see the result. This is, uh, if you want to make a longer wire, you can add end and uh, QW slash QW, okay? What about if you want to apply a gate acting on this qubit and gates? What is a gate? Is X. All right, this is our gate acting on the C qubit. What about if you want to control this gate by using this? I will copy this one. This is the first column, second column, third column, and fourth column. I want to control a gate that's located on the first column, and let me use control control one the row that is found uh, below this uh, row okay and don't forget to put this new row symbol then this is this will be in on new row once you find once you write this one and let us see the result this is our result what about to control more to put more controllers uh, right so i want to move controller and let me change these uh, names as a underscore a not and this one will be b underscore node in the b i want to the b also to control this the, the, the gate that controlled by the a all right this is our controller okay and another thing uh, what i'm going to start oh, you can you can add more control as you as long as you wish like this and that's all right let me change the name to s okay and if you want to add more wires just use this qw all right and again qw on this one also and qw on this one all right uh, here we go we have a, 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 a line a wire okay what about to if we wish to draw a swap operation between S0 and A0? All right, uh, between S0 and A0, I will have to again add a new column and oops, and a Q swap. All right, and what about on the second, on the B qubit? I don't want to happen anything on this while they are swapping and QW like always. But on this one, I want to make a swap operation. Um, Q 
swap with whom sir with q w x and in the array symbol uh, with respect to this position uh, this is minus one okay this is this is minus one this is minus two so i want to make a swap operation with minus two all right let us see the result this is the swap operation you can continue anything if you want to read more about it you can compile that q tutorial text file and look at uh, on the pdf file I hope this video is useful for you, don't forget to subscribe, see you in another video.